We've talked about bringing water with you to make sure that your dog would have something to drink while you're walking. If you're lucky, one of the, the place that you're walking in the woods will actually have water of its own. So right here we've come across a beautiful little stream and I'm going to invite the dog to go take a drink of water. Ursa, go get a drink of water. This is one of Ursa's favorite streams actually and more likely than not she's going to just actually take a little nap there in the water. There she goes, lies right down. Great way for your dog to be able to cool off. Today it's fairly pleasant temperatures, sometimes it can be very hot and uh, this breed of dog has a long, a long shaggy coat so it's important that they get to cool down. One thing you do want to be careful about with water when you're walking if it's very very hot and the dogs have been doing a lot of running around you don't want them to drink too much water. So you can hear Ursa's gagging a little bit because she's probably drunk a little bit too much water but she hasn't been running around and it's not that hot so I'm not worried about it. But having your dog be able to feel comfortable going into a stream like this is a great way for them to cool down, refresh. Something you want to start, again, when your puppy is young, expose them to water, expose them to streams. But do be aware if you're walking in winter and the water level has gone up. Hey, pumpkin. What you see? Good girl. Um, be aware of how fast that the water current is moving um, just so that your dog doesn't become at risk if it goes into a fast, water body, fast moving body of water. This is a very pleasant little stream, really no risk at all to the dog. Um, dog can certainly go in there and enjoy herself and uh, she can even go fishing for cookies. Hey Ursa, here, do you want to go find a cookie? Go get it.